Immortal John Hancock here, and as you can see, just been working on my game room, making some progress, but this video is not about that. I want to talk about kind of my changing, my changing gameplay preferences as time moves on. And so, uh, I just got done playing some of the Star Wars Battlefront 2 beta, multiplayer beta, and it was a lot of fun. But something that just kept really, really bugging me when I was playing it was just that it's just not my type of game anymore. And I was thinking about kind of how my likes and preferences of, of playing different genres over time has changed. I remember growing up and I would really play a lot of different things. You know, anything new, anything hot. It was, you know, whatever I could get my hands on, I would play. Whether it was sports, whether it was role-playing games or action games. I didn't really have a favorite type. I just kind of played it. If it was fun, great. Time went on, and then when I started collecting retro video games and, and, and getting in my teenage, you know, late teenage years, I really started pursuing stuff that I really liked. You know, games such as uh, Ghouls and Ghosts on Sega Genesis, Strider, Golden Axe, Streets of Rage 2. I really liked those action style games and you know kind of quick gameplay you know you can play for a bit and then just be done and as time went on i went through a different phase in college i got back into role-playing games you know playing final fantasy 7 i played a lot of that uh racing sims played gran turismo for a long time i really enjoyed those games and part of this was i was in college i was single and really it was my primary, my primary thing I did when I wasn't working or school. And then things changed again, you know, when I, uh, you know, I, I got married and uh, it settled down and, and had started having kids. It, again, things changed again. I, I honestly, when I, when I, you know, eight years ago, nine years ago, I was playing a lot of first-person shooters and was playing a lot of Halo and playing a lot of Call of Duty and those shooters were fun and I played them a lot and I enjoyed it and somewhere along the way I just stopped really caring about those type of games I don't know why I just I don't know it's not that they aren't fun uh, I really enjoyed Halo 4 played that a ton and it was kind of funny because one thing that like really for me was kind of a milestone or a aha moment was I got Halo 5 and the first Star Wars Battlefront at a, at a, at a holiday. I think it was two years ago. Two years ago? One year ago. Maybe two years ago. Anyways, and I just... I got them and I didn't play them that much. I just had hit my kind of, I'm done with these type of types of games. And it's not that they're bad games. That's one thing that some people say, of like when they, when they don't like a game, they'll just trash a genre saying that's a ter that those are bad games. And it's like, no, Star Wars Battlefront 2 is a f fun game. You know, I just, I'm just not into that. And I don't I know if it's because I know that it's, its progress is based on a server so that you know eventually those servers are going to go down and then all the progress of me playing this game in multiplayer at least is going to be lost forever that to me is a big turnoff i just i don't know i don't know if it's a level progression where i just i feel like i'm working when i'm playing a a, a game like that and you're leveling up a character i don't know uh diablo 3 that i don't feel like that that you know and i there's level progression in that, so it's not necessarily that. I don't know what it is, if it's, you know, just me getting older, but I just, I, I'm just not into them, and I, I don't know why. It kind of kind of bugs me in a way, but another way, I've, I've, I've had immense pleasure playing other types of games. A good example is uh, we had a, a local gaming event this week, and I showed uh, Calitz Gamers' second adventure for the first time in public, and it was awesome. And I was also playing a like a fun little multiplayer game called Towerfall. And Towerfall's on uh, multiple systems. It's it's a lot of fun. It's, think of like uh, Smash Brothers with 8-bit graphics. And I love games like that. And it, it's kind of 
quick multiplayer fun and done. And I, I think that's part of it is as I get older, I find that my time is more precious. And I have I feel like I have less time to invest into a game. I to me, a video game and enjoyment of playing a game is like the magic magic window is like 15 to 30 minutes. And I don't know why. I mean, other than, you know, I'm busy, I'm doing YouTube, I'm teaching, I'm building a game room, uh, in classic game room, by the way, so all my classic video games are going to fill the shelves in the back here. And, and those are the type of, types of games I really, really enjoy because I can play them, I can experience them for 15 minutes, I can play them with my kids, and then I'm done. And it's, you know, it's kind of like an encapsulated uh, gaming experience. And I don't know, you know, there's new games that that do that, and and I gravitate to those types of games. Um, and so I don't know, it's just kind of a kind of a ramble, but it just I find myself not liking long grinding games anymore, just because I don't have the time. Also, though, it just isn't fun to me. Like I was playing the the Star Wars Battlefront Two beta, and it's like it's not a bad game. It just I wasn't having fun playing it. I was just like, eh kind of done this before and I kind of it's it looks cool and there's some cool things with it it's just not my type of it's just not my cup of tea anymore and I you know maybe maybe the John Hancock eight years ago or ten years ago would have loved it not now and I, I just uh, I don't know it, it's almost in a way like I feel guilty about it in a way but part of me has just moved on so anyways kind of a long ramble but wanted to talk to the people who enjoy this channel and what are the games that you like to play? Are there types of genres of games that you just do not touch anymore? Have your types of games that you enjoy playing changed over time? Has this changed with family, being married with a partner, etc.? I'd love to hear from you. So anyways, uh, I am making progress in the game room. I'm exhausted. And uh, just just want to thank everybody for the, the wonderful comments and the progress. So if you notice, uh, these shelves haven't been bolted into the wall, so I know that. <laughs> I'm going to be doing this tomorrow uh, on my other day off, and, and hopefully going to get it nice and secure. Uh, you know, they're, they're going to be bolted into 1x4 stud, 1x4 uh, beams that are going to be connected to the wall with cabinet screws. And so it's going to be very secure. Anyways... Thank you so much for people uh, taking time of their day to watch any of my videos. It's greatly appreciated. Uh, I am late on a, a Patreon video, and I know that. And I'm going to be uploading that exclusively with a game room update. And so, anyways, thank you so much. I'm still doing three videos a week, one on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. I typically upload at 8 o'clock a.m. Pacific Daylight Time. I'm trying to do that a little bit earlier because of school. Anyways. Thank you so much. You folks are beautiful and wonderful. This is the Immortal John Hancock. Take care.